Although the tree next to me might look like it's gone dormant for the year, the leaves are brown, they're starting to fall off, there's still a fair amount of activity that's actually happening. During early fall to late fall, trees are still moving nutrients from the branches to the roots of the tree. The same is true in the spring when they are moving nutrients from their roots to their branches. We want to wait till winter for pruning to make sure that there is not any plant activity that is happening with the tree. When we prune off branches that are actively growing, moving sugars and water to and fro, we want to make sure that we're not robbing that plant of those vital nutrients. Along with pruning, we want to make sure that we're also being cognizant of the root system of the tree. We have lots of winter activities such as shoveling snow, plowing roads. We want to make sure that we're not damaging that area or damaging the trunk of the tree. Watering during the winter is also important. You can do this during warmer temperatures when that top layer of soil starts to thaw out. If there's not a good cover of snow, you will definitely want to think about winter watering to ensure the health of your tree. It's important to consider taking care of your trees, whether it's a deciduous tree or an evergreen tree, whether it's young, whether it's old, taking care of it during the winter to make sure that it's going to be healthy and vibrant for the spring. From the University of Wyoming Extension, I'm Brian Sebade, and you're watching From the Ground Up.